The whiteboard controls are annotations to the current presentation, which means you can mark up any presentation that you upload into BigBlueButton. We've tried to keep the whiteboard controls very simple. And if you want a traditional pure whiteboard, it's easy. Just upload a blank PDF, and then you have a blank slate. Let's take a closer look at the controls. There are three groups of controls, the drawing, pen, circle, square. You can clear and undo, and you can choose the color and thickness of the stroke. So let's take a typical example. Math seems to be the use case. So here's a sample math problem. Current ratio of boys to, school, to girls at a certain school is 2 to 5. If 12 additional boys are added to the school, the new ratio of boys to girls will be 4 to 9. How many boys currently attend the school? Okay, so let's solve this problem. We're going to activate the whiteboard controls. This is the button in the lower right-hand corner. You'll see the controls appear in the upper right. So by default, we've got a pen stroke, so we're just going to draw some lines. You can see them drawn. We can undo one, or we can clear them all. We'll choose square, so it's a straight-up drawing of a square. And the same with circle. Let's clear it all. So let's do the problem. So we're going to show the students who are all connected remotely. We're first going to highlight that the two ratios for boys to girls, 2 to 5, and if we add more boys, it's 4 to 9. So these are the key pieces. We're going to choose a smaller pen. And we're just going to zoom in a bit so that we can basically use the, uh, the entire area below to solve the problem. Activate the whiteboard again, and now we'll start going through the problem. Here, the first ratio is boys to girls. The first piece of information is uh, normally there's two boys for every girl. And if we add 12 more boys, then the ratio to girls in this case becomes 4 to 9. Okay, so those are the two equations we just have to solve for boys and girls. Very straightforward. I'm sure those of you are thinking back now to your days trying to solve these problems. A key point here is that each time the professor strokes, the remote students can see it as well. Stroke for stroke. Uh, I've just jumped ahead here. We're getting close to the solution. Again, uh, whatever the professor is showing on the screen, the remote students see exactly. If the professor zooms in, the remote students see zoom in as well. And the annotations as well are actually saved between slides, so I could go back and forth to the previous slides and I'd see any annotations there. They're not saved among sessions though. Uh, that will come in a future version for record and playback. So we're getting to the end. We now know that uh, 10 boys equals 9 boys plus 108 and solving for B, which is boys, it's 108. So if we zoom back out, we can see that the answer is E. And I'm just going to highlight it for the remote students. There we go. That's the answer. And that's an overview of the whiteboard controls.